Welcome everybody to today's long overdue review of Optimum Nutrition's Gold Standard Plant Protein. Before I get into the review, I just wanna say, I win the ugly sweater contest. Check it out. Bringing gains to the world with Santa. Now, I've tried many plant proteins, and this is probably my second favorite one. My favorite one was the Run Everything Labs one. This one came in second. Um, it comes with 24 grams of protein, 140 calories, four grams of BCAAs, four grams of glutamine. It's a pea protein base, so if you're trying to stay away from soy-based proteins, I would recommend this one. Um, Excellent source of B12, since all of us are B12 deficient and we're slowly dying. And it has protein, obviously, since we don't die of protein deficiency, which is often a concern of mine and everybody else's who, you know, when I tell them I'm vegan, but you know, you never know. Uh, complete profile of essential amino acids, 100% of daily vitamin C. Uh, it's made with the ancient grain complex of amaranth, quinoa, buckwheat, millet, and chia. Comes with organic pomegranate powder, no artificial colors, flavors, or sweeteners. Now, I've been using this one for about a week and a half now. It mixes great, it tastes great. A lot of the problems I have with plant proteins is sometimes they're grainy, and I hate grainy proteins. This one isn't, or not as grainy as all the other ones I've tried. So I'm super excited about this. Uh, I bought it on bodybuilding.com. It was actually relatively cheap. I think it was around 20 bucks, and you get 19 servings in here. So that's a pretty good deal. Um, sugars, you're only at one gram of sugar, six grams of carbs. Everything you probably want in a plant-based protein, this has, and it also tastes good. I got the vanilla flavored one, and I would definitely buy it again. So I'm gonna go ahead and mix it up for you and then show you the consistency of it. All right, I'm back. So, went ahead and mixed it, eight to 10 ounces of water. Check it out, not chunky, nice and liquidy. Deliciousness. It does taste like vanilla, which is good, which is what you want if you ordered the vanilla. If you didn't, you might wanna take it back because it went bad. So. This is my recommendation. I would probably give it about a nine out of 10 on a scale of this to Run Everything Labs one because the Run Everything Labs one was delicious. So if you get a chance, bodybuilding.com, I'll go ahead and leave a uh, link in the description. Make sure you go check it out. Make sure you like this video, subscribe, send it to all your other friends who think you're protein deficient and that you need protein to survive, which you do, just not the 200 grams that you thought you need to. But until next time, bye.